Good morning, you too, uh, my beautiful, beautiful, wonderful, glorious brothers and sisters in the Lord. Wednesday, October the 13th, it's almost my birthday, the 16th, Saturday, the Sabbath is Pastor Dave's birthday. Are you having coffee this morning? Are you having tea? Lemonade, it's a beautiful day in Michigan. The sun is just shining. It's a little bit chilly. There's a chill in the air. Now I'm getting hungry for some chili. Christy and I, Christy is off this week. We're going out to Flint, Michigan this week and feeding the homeless as best as we can. The offerings, the tithing to this ministry and channel. I don't know, we've had one offering so far this week, $20 from Brother Rob Estrada, $20 PayPal and uh, GoFundMe, our medical fund, as you know. Those that are new to this channel, I have recovered. I am a walking, talking miracle proof that Jesus heals. I'm a survivor of cancer, colon cancer and septus. I went into septic shock back in 2020 a year ago i was diagnosed with colon cancer i went through colon colorectal surgery and an aptus form and i had to go into emergency surgery and i went into septic shock and attacked my kidneys and my lungs and my organs i went into kidney renal kidney failure i was in a coma for I don't know how many months, I didn't even see last summer. I was in the hospital in intensive care. That's when COVID was going around and uh, I couldn't even have visitors. My wife couldn't even visit me and the doctors told my wife, let's just unhook life support. I was on life support. I had a tube in my uh, jugular vein for dialysis because my kidneys shut down. And let's let him go peacefully. She said, my God is bigger than your God. No. And I bounced back. I came back. Long story short, I'm here today. I've got one more surgery. The first of the year. We put it off till the first of the year. And I'm proof that God answers prayer. God does answer prayer. And Jesus heals. Jesus heals today. So... While you have your coffee or your tea or your lemonade, I'm going to have my water to keep my kidneys. I am no longer on dialysis. I am cancer free and dialysis free today. Somebody praise his name today. Well, I speak the truth on this channel, our main channel. This is our backup channel, Trumpet of God Ministries, our ministry, our main channel. The coming harpazo, the rapture of the church, is under attack by Google and YouTube for speaking the truth. We've got six more days. We're in YouTube jail. Two strikes on our channel. Six more days. I got a third strike, but they let me slide. They said, you already have two strikes. We're just going to let you go. Another community guideline strike. Uh, and then we can upload more videos to our main channel with, uh, what, 300,000 subscribers over there. But we are uploading uh, videos to YouTube. All the links will be below. And BitChute. BitChute.com, Pastor Dave. And YouTube. Not very many people on BitChute. Not very many people follow me on BitChute. And I don't know why. Brand new blog site, and the links will be below. It's our re, re, I re brought life back into my blog site, Pastor Dave's blog. Um, it's all about we the people now. It's for patriots over at our new blog site, and that link is below as well. And how you can give and tithe to this ministry. Have you been following the Gabby Petito, Brian Laundry? Um, uh, saga that has been going on this poor poor 22 year old girl and our prayers for her family and for the uh, laundry family I don't know what they could imagine me be going through uh, people were going to their door in the middle of the night uh, uh, harassing them and uh, I think you know it's in God's hands but the autopsy report came out yesterday uh, the doctor, uh, Dr. Blue, that uh, performed uh, the autopsy in Teton, uh, Wyoming, 
uh, the manner of death was strangulation. And uh, he was out cutting his grass this morning and the media was there uh, asking him questions and following him to the gas station. Uh, uh, just your opinion below. I, mean, I don't know how this is going to case is going to uh, turn around, but if he is alive, Brian Laundry, he, he shouldn't do the right thing and uh, let the wheels of justice uh, uh, turn and do the right thing. And hopefully he hasn't harmed himself because we, you know, we do not have a right uh, to interfere and, and take our own life. That's uh, God's timing for when we are to leave this earth. And let's pray for all involved in uh, this terrible, terrible situation. Too young, very for the young girl, just very too young. I love you guys. Pray for our ministry. If you like this channel, ring the bell. I'm a brand new subscriber. I want to thank you. I can't remember your name. I'm like 110 years old, but thank you. And you rung the bell. Ring the bell. Subscribe to this channel. Follow me over at BitChute. The links are below. Follow me over at YouTube and our new blog site as well. And uh, let freedom ring. And put your faith and trust in Jesus no matter what you're facing today. Nothing is impossible with God. And lift up your heads. Look up. He's coming. Your redemption draws nigh. Your crowns await you. You are kings and priests before our God. Jesus said, I will make you kings and priests before God. And you are welcome to the kingdom. Please accept Jesus today. Please get down on your knees and pray. There's power in prayer. I'm living proof. There's power in prayer. God bless you today. Please support Pastor Day's ministry.